Hello everybody and welcome back to a new video on my channel Langophilia. In this video I would like to explain to you how to conjugate the verb to want or to love in Albanian, especially in the Gig dialect from the north. So it is spoken in North Albania, in Montenegro, in North Macedonia as well as in Kosovo. I have my well focus on the Albanian language from Kosovo. So yeah, I would like to continue with the infinitive. This, this is the most basic form of a verb in English. We would say to want or to love. In Albanian, we have a similar structure. We say me dost. Me is like to in English and want or love. It means the same in Albanian. It is dost. Some people also say dest. I will talk about this later, but we will focus now on dost. So me dost is to want or to love. Now let's move on to the present tense. If we want to say I want or I love, we would say une, du or dua. In the standard, in the Tosk dialect, it would be dua, but many people in the Gag dialect say du, une, du. If we want to say I love you, we would say to do, to do uh, or to dua. To dua is the same. To do, to dua, I want you, I love you. If we want to say you want or you love, we would say ti, don, don. This is the same in the third person singular. So if we say he, she wants or loves, it would be I, I, yo, don, don. If we move on to the um, first person plurals, so we want or we love, it would be na, doim or doina. Doim, doina. In the standard language, this would be duam. So this is a bit different, but in the gig dialect in Kosovo, colloquial speech, most people would say doim or doina. Doina. In the second person plural, you want, you plural, y'all want or your love, it, this would be um, you doni. You doni. Then in the last form, they want, they love, this would be ata, ato, doin, doin. Now let's move on to the past. In the past we have several tenses. So first we have the aorist and the imperfect. The aorist is used for events in the past that are finished, that happened maybe only once, whereas the imperfect is used for events um, for continuous events in the past that happened several times over a longer period of, of time. And yeah, let's start with the aorist. So here we would say una dosta, dosta. This here is um, one of the two forms possible. So we also have, as previously mentioned, desht. Some people say desta, desta in the standard language this would be desha desha but we will move on with the gig dialect from kosovo so we would say dosta or desta you wanted or you loved this would be ti doste deste and in the third person singular it would be i ayo doste or deste doste Deshti. For we wanted, so the first person plural in the aorist, we would say na doshtem, doshtem or deshtem, deshtem. You wanted, you all wanted in the second person plural, we would say you doshti, doshti or doshtit with the t in the end. Some people leave it out, some people say it. Um, this is the same for the other form, deshti, deshtit. And in the third person plural, they wanted, they loved, it would be ata ato doshtin, doshtin or deshtin. 
In the imperfect tense we have again the stem doi and this is built with sha in the end for the first person um, singular so I want it in the English language we only have um, one simple past and we can't translate it correctly but if we want to say I want it in the imperfect tense this will be doisha doisha I want it and you want it would be ti doisha doisha for he she wanted it would be I ayo doike doike in the first person plural so we wanted it would be na doishim doishim in the second person plural you all wanted this would be you doishi or you doishit in the third person plural this is the last form this would be they wanted in, in english and um, they would say in albanian ata ato doishin doishin in the perfect tense we just need the conjugation of the verb to have me pause i already made a video on this verb which you can watch here again um, so if we know to conjugate this verb we um, just need um, to add the participle which is dasht or desht and then we would say come dasht i have wanted or i have loved or tk dasht i ka dasht na kena dasht you keni dasht ata to kan dasht so this is pretty simple just like in english i have you have you just need to conjugate the f uh, verb to have me pause and add the participle dasht or desht in the future tense this would be kam me dasht or kam me desht so we use again the conjugation of the verb to have and the infinitive kam me dasht me dasht is the infinitive and kam means i have so we literally say i have to want this is the future tense in the gig dialect kam me dasht and that's already it. I hope you learned something new today. Thanks very much for watching my videos and following me. This is very yeah, meaningful to me. I um, hope you can learn with my materials. Maybe check out my website langofilia.com. Also subscribe to my channel for further videos on the Albanian language in English and in German. Um, so yeah, thank you all. Falimendersh shumkredve. And see you next time on Lango Filia.